we are back i'm back with so many uh, skills all the way from ukraine uh, but before before we share those skills before i share with you everything that i've learned there is something i would like uh, to clarify on and uh, it's what has been done it's more of a review what has been done in this uh, section in this mid section uh, we planted did a weed killer did our first fertilizer uh, controlled for lanome and there is more that is needed to be done a top dress is needed to be done remember when you're planting we did a phosphorus rich fertilizer that was uh, those some i used a uh, dap plus uh, in your case you can use any product not necessarily dp as long as it's phosphorus based um, then did the weed killer as you can see the pre-emergence and post-emergence the field is very clean as, uh, as per now nothing that has germinated until now when this maze is of big height i think that when the weeds will come but i don't think they will they are going to bother the, the maze if they have not uh, germinated at this point so i wanted to clarify something because as we speak we are receiving a lot of rainfall here in kenya and uh, east africa in general and um, doing a top dress using granular fertilizer may become a challenge to farmers because you may end, you don't have you, you don't have enough time you have less or limited time to do uh, the fertilizer also you may end up losing your fertilizer because of the rainfall so which way do you go as we speak if you have done the planting fertilizer you can approach or you can use the tactic of using foliar foliars as fertilizers because foli fertilizer comes in different forms comes in foliar comes in granule uh, yes foliar and granule granule it may not be applicable at the time because of the flooding and everything go for foliar use foliar but follow the criteria if it's phosphorus based fertilizer use phosphorus foliar if it's a nitrogenous fertilizer use nitrogenous fo uh, foliar like in this case in my case at the moment i go with a calcium and uh, npk of uh, product because i'm at the top dressing stage and that hole that i need for me uh, to be able to push this maize farm to the next level hope you've learned something uh, from what this discussion if this is your first time that you're watching me don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel so that we can continue learning together bye